Yo, so what is going on guys? I'm back with another video and today I'm going over the Jordan 4 Starfish. Now in this video, I'm going over some of the least info, how to buy the site list and the resale value. I'll stop wasting any time and let's hop into it. So first we have the resale value. Now this sneak is going to retail for $200. That is the normal retail for all Jordan 4s. Now the resale is going to be around $220, $230. This isn't a very good colorway, the Jordan 4. Jordan 4 fours normally take a lot to get off the ground and it really increases market price so as you can see here this jordan 4 is going to resell for very low to start out with as you can see here you know the bids aren't that high right now now we are two days from the release and this screenshot is taken january 19th which is two days before the release now you know the demand isn't quite there and the colorway isn't quite it um you know jordan 1 mocha is like the last sneaker we saw with the primary color brown and those are doing extremely well but those are kind of like the poor man's travis scott's now these the brown colorway doesn't really hit on the jordan 4 especially with the other colors mixed in it's not that great but i can see you know the value in this sneaker uh going up um you know over time because that's usually what jordan 4s do and it's uh, normally a lot of stock on jordan 4s you know every you know uh, colorway that they do release so i can see the value of the sneaker increasing in the future now moving on to the silas now other sneaker dropping on january 21st 2021 now it's dropping on finish line at 10 a.m from jd sports nike sneakers foot locker east bay bodega dtlr champs and snipes all at 10 a.m eastern time on january 21st 2021 and now the best manual sites i'd recommend going is finish line jd sports and nike sneakers and snipes it's it, oh, it's a good manual site, but it takes forever because every two minutes you have to refresh your page and it's and it, it's a very labor inducing um, You know site to get your sneaker on but it does increase um, Your chance of getting them because it has better uh, bot protection Now moving on to at least some fun now, now the best size is sizes 9 to 12 and now these sneakers are exclusively dropping in the women's sizes so the largest size uh, for men is 10 and a half so if you wear bigger than that unfortunately you'll not be able to wear the sneaker uh, however in terms of resale the best sizes are going to be 9 through 12 it's always going to be the largest size when it comes to women's sneaker especially when you know when it comes to a popular jordan a lot of men like to wear the sneaker as well so that's why the bigger size is going to uh, do well and do better than the other sizes because it's in higher demand on the cop risk for this is pretty moderate now i know a lot of these sites have free returns i know you know for sure that nike has free returns if you do get it and you realize the market is not there you can always send it back get a full refund and take that money and reinvest it back into your business back into reselling um so there's no real risk when it comes to it but there is a risk of it flopping and having no potential to make any money at all uh, however if it doesn't make you a whole lot of money it's not a waste of your time because if you're trying to grow a business trying to get reps on ebay macari uh, you know, grail StockX, go your own instagram whatever it may be having those sales and having those reps is very very crucial and you know in order to grow in your business because you know uh, like if a customer is going to buy a product from you they would look at two sellers you know one seller that sold 30 products one seller that sold five and when it comes to sneakers and being a you know a ton of fake and a ton of scams out there when it comes to selling sneakers you know that buyer is going to go to the person who has 30 sales and 30 people vouching for them instead of the you know uh, you know instead of the seller at five so these brick flips they may not be worth your time in terms of net profit but they're worth your time in building reps and building a reputation also if someone comes after you and you know they want to buy this jordan four off you you only make ten dollars but then you know a month from now a jordan one releases and you have a couple pairs and they you know they want them for the personal collection then they're going to go back to you and buy that one and then you know that could profit you 50 to 100 dollars. so you always want to make sure you build connections and these brick flips are a great way to do so and now the access rate is low it's a jordan 4 everyone's going to go in for them they're going to sell out across the board um especially that's you know especially since there's not a lot of resale opportunity this month in january it's normally a pretty slow month because the holidays because you know, the holidays have just passed so everybody's going for them so i can imagine it'd be pretty tough to get now when it comes to selling your sneakers if you don't always sell on your own platform if you guys don't know where to sell my favorite is ebay and local meetups i love selling on ebay because the fees are very small and local meetups there's no fees at all and you build connections the best way through ebay and local meetups grailed is nice as well but they take a larger percentage but grailed you can also make connections so i definitely recommend grailed and then stock kicks and go they take a pretty sizable cut and there's no connections being made you don't actually talk to the person on the end you only sell through you know of that company so the buyer is technically only buying from stock x and go they're not buying from you um which you know loses that opportunity to make connection which is very important you know in this business in this game 
And I thank you guys for watching. I'll see you in the next video. And make sure you check out um, uh, the video popping up the screen. And make sure you like, subscribe. So I can push out more content for you guys. And I'll see you guys in the next one.